No one is going to from you, man. In other words, 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 Islam is the final religion. Muhammad is the final prophet. That's it. Show me. Where was Muhammad? I have a question. So, please, 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 please help me understand. I don't want to. You don't want to. I will burn in hell. I will burn in hell. You're going to hell, man. What's that? You're going to hell. I'll burn in hell? Yeah. Will you he be with me at that time? Hell? Oh, no. I'm not going wherever you're going. Don't be confused, sir. We're talking about something else right now. Don't talk to me. Yeah. Speak with them. Go ahead. So the problem... The problem... Why do you not do blasphemy? So Islamic scholarship. Islamic scholarship in operation here. Excuse me. Excuse me. Can a Muslim come and come and defend no, no, Islam okay. at all? So far, I haven't no, found any knowledgeable Muslim. Even the expression knowledgeable Muslim seems to be an oxymoron. And so no wonder our nation is seriously suffering today, my dear friends. Our nation is suffering. Things are burning. You are a Muslim, sir. So you may, maybe can help us. Don't speak to him, sir. So clearly there are issues that are caused in this country. In the last few days, people are angry, frustrated in relation to Islam. You are aware of that. What's Islam got to do with it? Ask him. I genuinely think... Yeah, well, I, I'm coming there. I don't know about the situation. We're talking about religion. Yes. I don't yeah, religion. Really. I want to talk to you about religion. You know, in, in I am a Christian. According to Christianity, we have values. Which, Deep values, values yeah. that we cherish. And I go through the Quran multiple times and I find none of these values here. Like what? Like, for example, love. Do you have God is love in the Quran? Yes. Please show me. What will, what will I know from my heart, I don't need to show you from this. No, no, you know you're from your heart, you show it from here. Look, your heart is in the Quran. The Quran is here. Ah. Show me where is God is love. Love what? Do you, are you Muslim? Yes, Alhamdulillah. I will turn up. I will turn Yeah, yeah, please. Please, if you please come here. Yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. God is love. I'd like to find love, out. Love what? <laughs> love, love, love what? No, no. God is love. No, what does God is love mean? I don't, this, this phrase is not it's, understandable. It's, it's, it's his very essence to love. Okay. It's his very so essence. Love anything? Well, of course, if he is God, he better us. So this is why you, do you think God, Islam is Allah? God, yes, God loves, yeah. okay, God loves the Muslim people, that is one love. God loves Muslim people, even human beings can do. What silly thing is this? Do you love your children? Yes, I love my children. Do you love my children? So even a human being can do what you are saying. But your children you love, my children love you don't love. That's what Islamic Allah does. The question is not clear. What is your question again? Please? I cannot tell you. Yeah, but if, you, if you please come here, I'm trying to come. So, Ask me a again, so God Ask is love. We're trying to find out if God. I, I now, free speech. Uh, you, you understand the expression free speech? Yes, I know. Do you have any any evidence of free speech in the Quran? Evidence of free speech in the Quran? Yeah. No, no, he's, Where he's, someone he's has denied Islam no, and is led to live yes, when Islam is, had the. Is, uh, please, please show. Please show. Please show. Please there is in the Quran, it says, okay, la ikraha bid-deen, which means, do you, do you understand that, la ikraha bid-deen? It means that you are not forced to follow a certain Where, where is this? In Surah Al-Baqarah. <laughs> are you kidding me? You, you, ask, you ask Have me. you read the Surah Al-Baqarah? I memorized Surah Al-Baqarah. I don't good, need to read good. it. So if you have... I bring it out to you now. Yeah, yeah. Okay. You so, have, you, have you read back Surah Al-Baqarah? Multiple times. Okay. And, and you yeah. haven't seen that verse? I have seen the verse. Okay, then why are you surprised? Why are you, asking, why are you surprised? I, I wasn't surprised. Okay, I was asking you, are you kidding? The reason I, am, I asked you that is, if you've read the entire Surah Al-Baqarah, you the entire would know... I have read the Quran, not only Surah Al-Baqarah. Sure. If you had read Surah Al-Baqarah carefully, yes. you would know one of the most violent chapters in the Quran is Surah Al-Baqarah. One of the most violent. Can I show you violent no. verses in the Quran, in, in Surah Al-Baqarah? Sure. Let me bring that up, one second. No, it was a Take out of <laughs> coming. Brother, say something brother, we don't he, know. He keeps jumping every different topic. I know. He's, yeah, you think he's going to say he, something we don't know? He asks question: Is God all loving? Uh, no, God is love. I don't know what that means. Yeah, tell him to explain. Why is he jumping? I know you don't know what Ask it means, but that's precisely the problem I'm trying to point out to my dear friend. It seems like it's all the place. He's jumping one two topic. 
Fight in the way of Allah. Fight in the way of Allah against those who fight against you. Okay. Those who fight against you. So, your argument is done. Fight for the name of Allah. No, no, Akhi, Akhi, please. We have time. Those who fight you and do not become just John Christian. You have to read anything. You should die already. Yeah, what? So, your argument is done. That's it. Halas, it's finished. Is that so? Hold on, hold on. I, th I thought you were expert on the Quran. Arrow, what's happening? You're struggling now. You said you read the Surah to Baqarah. So Surah two, uh, uh, Surah Al Baqarah, Ayah two and six. Read the whole context. Yeah, read the whole context. Let's read the whole context. Warfare is ordained for you. Warfare. 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 Warfare is ordained for you, though it is hateful to you. But it may happen that you hate a thing which is good for you. And it may happen that you love a thing which is bad for you. So they question you with regard to warfare in the sacred month. Say warfare in its in it is a great, but to turn from the way of Allah and to disbelieve in him and in the inviolable place of worship and to expel his people from there is greater. Uh, with Allah. The persecution is worse than killing and they will not cease from fighting against you till they have made you renegades from your religion if they can. And who becomes a renegade and dies in disbelief such are they whose works have fallen both in the world and the hereafter. So, uh, so this, this, okay. So please explain. First of all, I read it in Arabic. Uh, no, no, English is fine. No, no, no. So, what's wrong with the verse? So far we have read in English. English is fine. Yeah, what's wrong with it? First Ask him, brother. Let's, no, let's explain this, okay? Brother, yeah, please. Sorry, sorry, sorry. No, for my Muslim audience. Yeah. كتب عليكم القتال وهو كرز لكم وعسى أن تكرهوا شيئا وهو خير لكم وعسى أن تحبوا شيئا وهو شر لكم والله يعلم أنتم لا تعلم. And this is the this is the ayah that you read in English, okay? So what Allah said, but you, you haven't explained it. You just read it, okay? You didn't. You didn't. Excuse me. Are you getting to the explanation right yes, now? Yes, I am. Please, thank you. But, but you don't brought, touch me. Don't okay, Brother, you, ask you. You brought up. You brought up the the ayah, okay? Without even explaining why it's violent. Fighting warfare. It's so talking any, about any, warfare. So any, Brother, I can clarify. Any, 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 I can clarify. Yes, yes, okay. So you're saying that any warfare. I, I, I have now clarified. Okay, come Clearly, on. you didn't understand English. I'm now clarifying. So, warfare, <laughs> warfare is ordained for you, though it is hateful for you. So, as Muslims, tell me what's wrong with that. Did you ask me to explain? No, no, no. Just no, 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 that Muslims have been asked to fight, have been have been asked to fight. But please, uh, point it. Yeah, you can film if you want. Muslims, Muslims have been asked to fight because they the threat that they face is that they somehow will be disbelievers. That 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 is the threat. You can move forward. If you go through the entire Quran, you will not be able to show me one evidence of someone who actually violently persecuted Muslims at all. The only threat that they face is that they will cease being Muslims. And at the face of this threat, they have been asked to fight and kill, kill unbelievers. So please tell me, in other words, in other words, if a Christian comes here to speak a scholar and tries to explain to a Muslim that being a Muslim isn't great, you need to cease being a Muslim, that will be seen as a threat and you will fight against Muslims. This is Islam. Now you tell me, 
me, you tell me, is this is this biased? Okay, very good. No, I understand. Every human being has to show, show respect between each other. I don't know you. I don't know you. So you what don't say are you to respect first of all we don't so that's, deny your, that's your ideology that there you don't have to respect for Islam. Islam. again what's, what's my religion got to do with this your ideology yeah what's that got to, what's that got to do the same religion your ideology Again, you're what I'm not denying that. Like you don't like you. No, no, no. no. You live in the same place in India. Okay, millions, millions of people died in India. Millions of people. Now you are talking about Islam. That's where the issue is. You don't know anything about history. 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 Allah is telling the Muslim that you are allowed to fight. I'm going to talk to you the other way. Don't, don't worry. Your fellows, is that your friend? No, I don't know. Is that your brother? I don't know. Is that your Islamic brother? I don't know. Him. Is that your Islamic brother? I told you, I don't know. What's Are you listening to me? I want to ask you if you know him. I don't him. know if he's a Muslim. I'm asking. He is, he is a Muslim. Yes. Okay. If you just ask him not to harass, no, just I'm not harassing him. He's the one harassing him. He's nagging like last week. Please, 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 yeah, yeah, please go. He's the one who's harassing me. Now, I'm telling okay. you that I'm you, to to you are allowed to fight. Oh, okay. to he doesn't Islam. want me to yes. go. That's why. Right. You just went so into it. You just walked directly in my line. No, no. Directly in my line. No, no. we can make a little kind of film and edit the line. Stop lying. Stop lying. Stop lying. Stop lying. I'm allowed to kill you. That's what you understand. Stop lying. That's what the verse is saying. But don't get in the line of it. You heard that they say that's what the church is saying. So you have to agree with you. I'm not allowed to fight. I'm sorry about this, but this is Islam for you. Islam. Again, Please read this. Yeah, sadly. But it may happen. Why you keep okay. The question with regard yeah. to warfare in the sacred month. Listen, you'll find out. Warfare in it is a great transgression, but to turn from the way of Allah. What is to turn from the way of Allah? Continue. What is to turn from the way of Allah? Read, read the whole context. Okay, fine. You won't answer. Let me answer. That's fine. That's fine. I'll, I'll, I'll comment. So, if what are you, what are Muslims supposed to fight about or fight preventing something? You're, you're supposed to fight preventing the possibility that you will leave from the way of Allah. What is the way of Allah? Okay, wait, wait, wait. You said you're not going to explain. I am explaining right now. No, we don't need you. Come Essentially, the threat that the Muslims were no, confronting is that they'll suddenly not become, not be, not continue being Muslims. That's a lie. Not follow the way of Allah. And so, if you ever face the threat that you won't follow the way of Allah, you're supposed to fight back. In other words, you're not fighting because someone has attacked you physically, but you're fighting because someone is trying to convert you. Convert you. Okay, let me let me read. Let me read. Let me read. Warfare in it. Wait, wait, wait. Why don't you come in? Why don't you come in? Why don't you stay quiet? We're speaking to this gentleman. Why don't you come in? Warfare. India doesn't recognize the Adwasis. Excuse me. Why does India? Are you a little bit confused right now? Are you a little bit confused right now? Stay put. Stay put. Stay put. Warfare in it is a great transgression. But, but. To turn yeah. men from way so of Allah. Right you see, you either fight or you turn from the way of Allah. Yeah. So in other words, you either fight or you cease being a Muslim. That is the, that, those are the alternatives presented. Tell me about Adwasis. And let me, let me continue. And to disbelieve in him. You see the threat? The sudden threat the Muslim what, what face, okay, okay, oh, okay. somehow okay. you will disbelieve in Islamic Allah. How okay. could one okay. disbelieve in Islamic Allah? Yeah. Someone yeah. could yeah. convince yeah. them yeah. that Islamic yeah. Allah isn't yeah. 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 You are confused, bro. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. 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 You are so confused. The point, yeah. India is the nation of Adwasi. Yeah. 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 He is the answer. Thank you very much. Okay, let me speak. Thank you very much. So you see the problem? I'd like you to agree. I'd like you to agree. Let me finish. And then you can. So clearly, whereas you tried to change the verse earlier, the verse is very clear. You fight because you don't want to cease being a Muslim. You don't fight because someone attacked you. Now please clarify. First of all, the context of this ayah or this ayah, that verse that you have just quoted, okay? To understand it, you have to know why why this why this ayah was revealed. Can I explain to you that? No, I want you to read the ayah, explain the ayah first, before going to any context, please. The, the Quran actually said the question. So, yes, so there is a reason why this ayah came down and was revealed. Yeah, where, where do you read it? 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 Where
Where is that? Where is that? Okay. Please. Yes. Where is that? What does yes alone? Okay. They're asking, that they're asking the prophet about the question, and Allah has answered. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. So what was the question? Can, yes. about, about warfare. Warfare. No, no. Yes. Alone warfare alone in the second month. Second month. Okay. So the question was here. Okay. Is that because according to the Arab Arabs, at the time of Islam, okay, it was not allowed to fight in the months of which were sacred, the four months okay, in the Arabic calendar, which fighting was not allowed. And it happened that during this time, okay, one of the Muslims had killed Okay. Don't give me fancy stories. Stick with the context oh, in the Quran. Yeah, right. Stick with the context in the Quran. He doesn't want to so, okay, no, he doesn't okay, I'll let you finish. I'll let you finish. And then, no, please, please, I'll let you finish. Let me, please finish. Please finish. Yeah, please finish. Yeah. You, you, you lose your time. You lose your time. Okay. Well, well, okay. Please finish. So now the, 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 the pagan Arabs were questioning Muhammad's integrity that you are claiming you are claiming, okay, that you are not allowed to fight in the sacred month. Yes, one of yet one of your companions had killed someone, okay? So this ayah is answering this issue, okay? So I'm not making up these things, okay? I'm happy? not giving you any uh, stories as you're saying, okay? This happy? is the reality of sure, it, okay? Sure. Are you happy? So, why, why should I be happy? Sure, have, have you finished? No, I'm not finished. I'm okay, still go answering. Go he doesn't want to read okay. the truth. He just wants so to So what argue. the Quran is saying, okay, even though this act was a mistake, okay? But the other things that those pagans were doing are worse than this. What, what were they doing? Well, they, they were not. They, they were disbelieving in Quran, which we call kufr, in the uh, in, in Allah, and they were fighting the Muslims. So this this ay this surah this sadun an sabilillah means to fight and to prevent Islam from being spread. So the things that they were doing is worse than killing one person in the sacred month. So you people who are pointing fingers at Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam and at his. Uh, 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 followers, okay, for killing one person, they were doing things that were worse than killing one person. They were killing multiple people who were trying to spread the word of Allah and the religion of Allah. Sure. So it's not about killing anyone just because they disagree with us. And if you want to understand that that is the concept of Islam, you have to read the whole, the Quran its whole context. And if you go to Surah Al Mumtahana, for instance, no, 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 I'm not okay, going anywhere. I, I you want to understand no, 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 what. No, 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 okay, no, 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 let's stay. Let's stay. Okay, let's, let's stay. Let's stay. That's why the Surah Al Baqarah says La Let's stay. Let's stay. That's why. That's why, that's why the Quran says in the same Surah. If you don't want to go anywhere else, okay, and you want to stay in Surah Al Baqarah, you can see that there is La Ikraha fi Din. قد تبين الرشد من الغيب فمن يكفر بالطاغوت ويؤمن بالله فقد سمت happy وين ماش وين ماش فينا بيها so here is the problem my dear friends I think you're wasting your time. Honestly, don't touch me. I told you multiple times. You can touch me. Don't touch me. Thank you. So my problem, my here is the problem. Where does it say in this verse that you're allowed to kill every single people who doesn't believe in what you believe in? Please listen. Now I'm responding. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So you've given me a fancy story. It's not a fancy story. I'm speaking right now. It's fancy. I'm speaking right now. No, but don't don't accuse me of saying things. I'm speaking right now. Okay, speak. That's the entire idea of speaking. When I speak, I'll contradict what you've said. That's the entire idea of speaking. Don't say fancy. If you like, please. So please. Don't say fancy. Don't say fancy. What's your problem, sir? Okay, What's your problem? You're not are you confused? No, you are confused. you confused? You're confused. Look, your drink isn't doing you well. Maybe the toilet is there. If you're confused, yeah, maybe you just put your shake there. Okay. Okay. No, okay. Okay. Coming to you, sir. Respond so to my you're, you're, yeah. So your ideas, mm -hmm. you gave me a nice fancy story, okay. in my view. Fancy. And your, your idea okay. was that this surah, mm -hmm. this ayah says, that Muslims are allowed to fight because apparently some Muslims were killed. That's your fancy story. No, you don't understand you... my story. Okay. Let me finish. That wasn't what I said. Okay. Can I now finish and then yeah. you can yeah. clarify, I'm add just, more I'm fancy to your story? You. I'm just correcting you because that's what, that's Look, what I said. Can I speak now? And yeah, then you can... <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. So, let's read the ayah carefully again let's read it. and help us understand. Let's, okay, let's try let's and understand. understand. What is it saying? 216, Ayah 216, Surah Bakara, Ayah 216 says, Warfare is ordained for you. So Muslims have been asked to fight. That's clear in 216. In Ayah 217, let him continue. In Ayah 217, it goes on to say, They question you with regard to warfare in the sacred month. And then now look at the comparison drawn. Say, this Islamic, the, 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 whoever this guy is who is receiving the verse, he's asked to say, say, warfare in it is a great transgression 
but to turn may, men from way of Allah. You see what the threat was? If you don't fight, the trick. they will turn you away from the way of Allah. Which uh, in other words the means, trick, the trick, the magic in other trick. words, it Yo. isn't saying, in, in other words, what it isn't saying, it isn't saying that if you don't fight, they'll kill you. Is that what it is saying? Was what is being said here? No. What is being rather said is very simply, if you don't fight, you will cease being Muslims. Why would a gentleman like him cease be a Muslim? He will be convinced that Islam isn't true. That's what will make him cease being a Muslim. And then it goes on. And what does it say? Warfare in it is a great transgression, but to turn men from the way of Allah. That's the first reason. If you don't fight, they'll turn you from the way of Allah, number one. And number two, and to disbelieve in him. To disbelieve. Oh, wow, wow. How violent, physically violent, that someone will make you stop being a Muslim. How incredible. And therefore, no wonder, even in the UK, they go around, even at Speaker's Corner, threatening people. When true, Christians that's true, that's true. try and expound on Islam, they come around threatening, you know, intimidating. Why? Because they see that as a threat. Of course, this is not Islamic State, and therefore they don't end up killing you. Say, taking the warfare is ordained for you seriously. Because it is the UK, their hands are tied. And all that they are trying to do is intimidate, get away with physical aggression within the middle. Now, please explain to me again, sir. You gave me some fancy idea that someone was killed and so on. And, and that is the only reason this verse was revealed. Okay. Can you show me that fancy idea from here? Okay. Show me, use the context, explain all, to me, please. Okay. It's my turn now, okay? First of all, the Quran, okay, is not only about this eye that you are trying to explain the way you want, okay? And the, fan, the, the fancy, I think, that you're talking about, because we as Muslims, we believe in other sources that are authentic, and one of them is the Hadith, okay? And in the Hadith, this was, men, it was mentioned, this, this fancy thing that you're accusing me of making up is mentioned in the Hadith, okay? So I didn't just make this up. But the uh, other ring, one, sorry, one second, ring. The battery is gone, okay? Oh, yeah? Oh, maybe you didn't switch on or something. Okay, uh, <laughs> so, okay, sorry. okay, now I just. Now, so, please now, tell me, now, sir, now, can, okay, can you please, for the okay, sake of my now, now, So, you said uh, what, what, what I called okay, as fancy story. No, please, no, please start again. Sorry, apologies. Are you a Hindu nationalist? One minute. Okay, now you are refusing. You are refusing. One minute, please. How come Hinduism does not acknowledge I'm Muslim? Okay, I'm not into that discussion. Now, uh, now, this guy here is not allowing me to go to another verse in the Quran to explain this ayah, okay? And if we go to another Quran in Surah Al-Mumtahana, it clearly explains the Islamic concept of fighting. So let's go to Surah Al-Mumtahana and get that verse and show you. But you're, you're not allowing me to go there because you want to stick to your explanation of this verse. So you explain. You I've read the verse. I've already explained it. I've already explained no, no, it. No, read the verse. Explain no, so to me. Do you read the part? from the verse. But to turn men from, men from the way of Allah. Okay. Do you to see turn, that? To turn the way... In Arabic, it's wasaddun an sabirillah. That is what the, to turn the, Arabic, the way of Allah. What does that mean? Wasaddun an sabirillah is to prevent people from guiding others to the uh, religion of Allah. Are okay? you being a Muslim? Okay. Yeah, being a Muslim. Being a Muslim. So yeah, essentially, the, the threat but, 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 is that you would be sorry, Muslim. Sorry, That's the threat. Wait, wait, so wait. wait. So he's being a Muslim. Allah, Allah is making an, a comparison here. If you if you if you read it carefully, instead of telling me to read it carefully, you, you are the one who is like, ignoring the phrase. No, no, I'm not. There's a comparison here which yeah, is being yeah. made between two things. Yeah. Allah is telling me that this is worse than this. What okay. is worse? Please tell me. Worse is, the, in, is that you fight and kill rather than cease being a Muslim. That's you what it's saying. You ask the question and you're asking yourself. Go, go, okay. sorry. What is worse than uh, the other thing is that Allah is telling you uh, disbelieving in Allah okay, is worse than killing one person even though that killing is wrong. Uh, you see, so you, you agreed with me right now. In other words, the threat of ceasing... Mine? The threat of ceasing being it's not a Muslim. About the threat. What is what is disbelieving oh, no, in Allah? No, what, it's not no, about in, a, in other words, in other words, it's not if the environment the is eye, such, the is in, in other words, enough. in other words, yeah. in, if the environment is in such a manner, okay. you will disbelieve in Allah. Then you have been asked to fight. 
Is that isn't that the right? Do you see anyone okay, so fighting? So please explain to me. What's your argument? Threat? What is worse what's than what? Argument? Okay, okay, wait, please wait, listen. wait, wait. What's your argument? I You're not paying attention. No, no, I want to listen to you. Look, I want to understand. Don't touch you. me. I've told okay, you many times. Understand you. Now, if I you want to understand, you. don't touch okay, me. That's the first thing to understand. Let's establish the don't question. Don't touch me. That's the first thing to understand. Okay, I didn't touch you. Thank you. Establish the question. What's your argument? What's your argument? That I'm Muslims to want to kill everyone? I'm do you speaking. see anyone killing you? I'm speaking. Do you see many Hindus? <laughs> oh, do, do I see no, any no, Muslims let's, let's, killing anyone? Where, where? Do you see Hindus killing have you got, Muslims? Have you, got, I, I, well, no, have you got a problem with your eyes, sir? No, wait, do you read the newspaper, sir? Answer, answer me instead of trying to. Okay, the gentleman asked me a question, and that's a sensible question to ask. He's asking me, hey, if this is true, then people must be killing others. Do you see Muslims killing others? All day long, you should just go through the newspaper articles, read about what's happening in Nigeria. Are you now afraid? Do you know what is happening in Nigeria? Do you know what's happening in India? Do you know what is happening in Somalia? In other words, you, are, you asked me a question. You asked me a question earlier. You asked me a question earlier. What's happening in India? Are Muslims killing others? Is the question the gentleman asked. Now he is afraid. Listen, listen. My dear friends, who knows the answer to this very simple primary school question? Are Muslims killing non-Muslims across the world? Do they kill what is the answer? Here, here, here. I will yes. answer. I will answer. Where are the Muslims? I will answer. I will answer. Why? 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 Are you, are you specially here. confused? No, no. Why should you answer? Everyone knows the answer already. Muslims are Muslims killing non-Muslims across the world? Yes. Can Every I single Can day. I Can I answer? What's happening in Pakistan? What's happening in, What's happening in Afghanistan? India. What's happening in Nigeria? What's happening in Armenia? What's happening even in the UK? My dear friends, I, I don't know if you're aware. Islam, Islam has been officially declared to be a mental illness. We haven't finished. Just about ten days ago or so, there is no point of an army. Excuse me. Just let us answer. Thank you. Who's the Muslim? Here, please, thank you. That's Muslim. Look, look, look. What? Okay, That's Muslim. Too many energy drinks. Not in all in Nigeria. In every, everywhere in the planet. Do Muslims kill others? That's Muslim. Do kill Muslims? innocent people. Say yes. Do others kill Muslims? Innocent people. Who is innocent? Do others like, kill Muslims? You talking oh, about like two, two wars? Like Boko Haram. Two, Boko Haram, Just when they kidnapped he, he, he going, going hundreds of play, children, did they kidnap what was, what was the explanation what was going outside of the, the Quran? Was it? Is, right. Sorry? Muslim, was your explanation you going outside of the Quran? Of no. We, uh, you said about a specific that. event, of those, oh, yeah, okay. which yeah. is not in the verse. Yeah, wait, the Muslim gentleman, the great blue t shirt gentleman, as I read, and therefore he says he condemns, and therefore every one of us should be happy and move on. It's against Islam. In Islam, if we you were talking kill about any one, civilian or any one, if you're living thing, we're not, of course, we're not taking any So you're Quran. saying we're not allowed to explain the Quran from, from, from this uh, hadith, from the Prophet saying? Here's the problem. When you go to Hadith to explain the Quran, it goes against your own verse. Because in your own verse, it says the Quran is a detailed explanation of all things. But it can't be if you go outside the Quran to explain it. You with me? You with me? Simple logic. You as a Muslim, what are you doing? I'm quoting the Quran. What are you doing? Any Muslim, any Christian, any Jew, anyone, kill a civilian. Or a child, or a woman, or someone who's That's not fighting you, Shukran. we condemn Shukran. that in Islam. Oh, yeah, we condemn Akhi, that you can check out my channel. No, Islam doesn't Boko tell you. What are you telling the blue no, 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 He doesn't even know. He does not even know who Boko Haram is. Can I ask you something? How about Hamas? Can I, what should we do to Hamas? Can I ask you something? No, 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 the Muslim that they can use right now. I've asked you just question. answer. Yeah, just you answer. Just the Muslims, answer the Muslims who got killed in India. Talking. Do you think it's, it's him, their own? Which Muslims do you have? Ask him. There are hundreds of Muslims who get which killed one, in India. You I want to tell you names. Tell me names of I just wanted to get one minute. I just want to because I I know it in Arabic. Okay. No. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. I mean the ah, yeah. yeah okay. Now uh, we were we were having a discussion about 
the ayah that he was explaining and trying to say. Which verse was it? He was talking about يسألونك عن الشهر الحرام قتال فيه قل قتال فيه كبير. So he's trying to say that this is this ayah means that Muslims are allowed to kill anyone who disagrees with their beliefs or their thoughts. Okay. So this is the fallacy. First of all, because historically, historically, Christians have lived in peace under Islamic rule. So if Islam was there to kill all non-believers, whether Christians or Jews, then they would not be allowed to live under Islamic rule in peace. Okay, and that is a historical fact that everyone knows about. That is one thing. The other verse that I was trying to go to, that he didn't allow me. He wants. He's, he's just trying to hold me in that with that verse without trying to go to other verses to explain that was the ayah in surah the verse in surah al-muntahana where allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says la yanhaakum allah an alladhin lam yuqatilukum fi ad-din wa lam yukhrijukum min diyarikum an tabarruhum wa tuqsisu ilayhi inna allah yuhibbul muqsitin inna ma yanhaakum allah an alladhin qatalukum fi ad-din wa akhrajukum min diyarikum wa zahiru ala ikhrajikum an tawallahum wa man yatawallahum fa ulaika hum adh-dhalim so there is a distinguishment here between two people or two types of non-believers, one um, of which... Sorry, if you could give the verse... Um, it's Surah Al-Mumtahana. No, yeah, yeah. Um, to English translation. Yeah, English. That's why I want to bring it bring it up, okay? Surah Al-Mumtahana. Your mic, your mic. Huh? Your mic. I don't have the... Yeah, if you can... I don't have the English. Okay, one minute here. I have... I want the Surah Al-Mumtahana in English. It's very clear. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it's, it's very, this is the English. Surah Al-Mumtahana. I'm going to the Quran, Baba. No, no, the Arab, the Arab. I'm going to say, I'm going to say, I'm going to say, I think it's here. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's here. Surah Al Mumtahana, Ayah 8. Can you bring it out in English? Okay. So let's read it here. So it says in English Allah does not forbid you from dealing kindly and fairly with those who have neither fought or driven you out of your homes. Surely Allah loves those who are fair. Okay? And the other one, the next one, so I just continue here. Okay, Allah only forbids you from befriending those who have fought for you, for your faith, driven you out of your homes, or supported others in doing so. And whoever takes them as friends, then it is they who are the true wrongdoers. So there's a clear distinction between two kinds of non-believers, one of which you are allowed to be kind to and not allowed to fight, and other that you are not allowed to be kind with and you are allowed to fight against. And those who are hostile against Islam, those who have killed Muslims, those who have driven you out of your homes, those are the people that you are allowed to fight. Because of the religion, yeah. Okay, but those who haven't done those things, you are asked to be fair and kind to them. So what he is trying to say is that in all cases, against all non-believers, Muslims are asked to fight. And that is nowhere in the Quran, and it has not ever in any period of Islamic rule, it has not been practiced throughout all in Islamic history, Muslims have not killed Christians or Jews or other non-believers just because they were non-believers. They were allowed to live under Islamic rule in peace under certain conditions. Okay, Those who were fought against were those who were hostile against Muslims, were fighting Muslims, supporting uh, people who were fighting Muslims, driving them out of their homes. So it's very clear. But he was just you know, trying to, you know, twisting the, verse. twisting the verse and trying to explain it the way he wants. And this is what these Christians do. Sorry.